In this video, we're going to discuss about divergence criteria. So yung divergence criteria dito, ipuprove natin na yung limit ay hindi nag exist o kaya yung limit ay not equal to L. Using the idea of the sequence. So, let A be subset of R, F be a function from A to R, and C, a real number, be a cluster point of A. Then, number 1, yung limit ng f of x as x approaches c is not equal to L. If merong mag -e exist na sequence, x sub n in A, where x sub n must not be equal to c for all natural number n. That means, lahat ng terms ng x sub n, ng sequence x sub n, ay distinct sa c. Okay? Such that, yung limit ng x sub n is equal to c or yung sequence x sub n nagko-converge sa C. But, kapag nilagay na natin siya sa function, yung limit ng f of x sub n will not be equal to L. Okay? Then, for number 2, yung f does not have a limit at C, or uh, sa real number, kapag or if and only if there exists a sequence in A with x sub n not equal to C, so similar sa una for all natural number n such that limit of x sub n is equal to C, but f of x does not converge in R. Okay, so ito yung gagamitin natin to prove that the limit does not exist, okay? or yung case for number 1. So, hindi natin siya ipuprove. Magbibigay na lang ako ng example. So, let's have example. Okay, so for example, number 1, show that limit of 1 over x as x approaches 0 does not exist in R using the divergence criteria okay so for our proof so let f of x be 1 over x for positive x okay so bakit positive x kasi i-relate natin siya sa sequence Okay. So now, i-gawin natin sequence siya. Convert natin to sequence. Let the sequence x sub n be 1 over n. The sequence 1 over n for any natural number n. So mamaya, i-ano natin yan dyan. Napapakita natin yan. Okay. So, where n is natural number, ah, then, by using divergence criteria, so, ang gagawin natin dito, i-assume natin yung limit ng sequence, given sequence, ay nag -e exist Okay? But, yung f of x, or f of x sub n, hindi nagko-converge. Okay, yung ito. Okay. So then, kapag kinuha natin yung limit ng x sub n, limit of x sub n, that is limit ng 1 over n, as uh, for n natural number n yan ha. So kapag nag increase yung 1 over n yan, from 1, 1 half, 1 third, 1 fourth, 1 fifth, san, san siya na ko-converge? So, nagko-converge siya sa 0. Okay? For n greater than 0. So, yung 1 over n, nagko-converge siya sa 0 for n greater than or equal to uh, uh, n greater than or equal to n. Now, but, kapag isa-substitute natin to sa function, sa given function na limit of f of x sub n. 
is equal to limit of f of 1 over n. I-substitute natin yung 1 over n dito. Yan yung purpose ka, ba ka bakit x, sub x greater than 0 yung ginamit natin for x greater than 0. So, substitute natin. This is uh, 1 over, substitute natin 1 over n dito sa x, 1 over n. Okay. Uh, limit pala nyan, limit 1 over 1 over n. And that is limit of n. And ano yung limit ng n? As n greater than or equal to n. Or as n increases. So that is positive infinity. So n increases nga eh. Okay, so nagda-diverge siya. Which is not belong to R. Okay, so therefore... Limit of 1 over x as x approaches 0 does not, uh, does not exist in R. Okay, so ganun lang kasimple ha. Meron tayong function, so dyan natin substitute mamaya yung f of x sub n. Gagamit tayong assumption and then dapat mapakita natin na yung assumption natin ay converge. And then, pag sinubstitute natin, dapat mapalabas natin na hindi siya nagko-converge. Okay, so another example, number 2. Okay, so for number 2, show that yung limit x sub 0 ng SGN does not exist. So, ano yung SGN? Yung signum function. Okay. So, ano nga ba yun? So, yung signum function, that is a function or piecewise defined function defined by negative 1 if x is less than 0, 0 if x is equal to 0, 1 if x is greater than 0. So, yun yung signum function. Kung baga, sign lang. Okay? So, ang paano ba basahin yan? Sign ng function, signum function. Okay. So, now, kung igagraph natin to, ganyan yung itsura niya. So, graph natin. So, ito yung 0, x greater than 0, ganyan siya. x less than 0. Okay. Negative 1. Ito yung negative 1. Ito yung positive 1. Ito yung 0. Okay. So, prove natin na kapag yung x nag-approach sa 0, ah, uh, yung limit nitong signum function hindi nag-exist. Okay, so now, mag-let ulit tayo. Uh, let x sub n be the sequence defined by, uh, let's say, negative 1 quantity raised to n all over n for any natural number n. Okay, so bakit yan yung nilet natin? Kasi nga, yung sequence dapat nagko-converge sa 0. So kung titignan natin yan, Negative 1, 1 half, negative 1 third, 1 fourth, negative 1 fifth, 1 sixth. So, kahit anong side dyan, kahit yung negative or positive, pareho lang tong nag approach sa 0. Yung positive part tsaka yung negative. So, that means, or then, yung limit ng x sub n natin is 0. Okay. So, by the way, naglalet lang tayo ng isa kasi nga yun yung sabi. There's a sequence. Merong sequence na S is uh, in A which is X sub N not equal to C. Kung baga dito, dapat yung mga term na ito hindi mag-equal sa 0. Okay? Such that, dapat yung limit na yun na pinakita mo 
ay nag na ay equal sa C or dapat yung sequence na yon nagko-converge sa 0. So katulad nga nito yung nilet natin na sequence ah uh, yung bawat terms niya distinct sa 0 pero yung sequence na yon ay nagko-converge sa 0. And then but f of x does not converge in R. So yun nga ang kailangan natin palabasin. Dapat yung f of x sub n uh, hindi siya nagko-converge. Or walang limit yung f of x sub n. Dapat yung f of x sub n does not exist. Yung limit niyan. Okay? Now, if we substitute x sub n dito sa f of x, f of x sub n. So, ang mangyayari dyan, ang laman kasi ni x sub n, negative tsaka positive lang. Yung mga negative part, part nasa add number ng subscript. So, x sub 1, x sub 2, x sub 3, x sub 4, x sub 5. Yung add number na subscript, negative. So, that means negative 1 if n is odd. Tapos, positive 1 naman if n is even. And as you can see, may dalawang values. Okay? So, kapag n is odd, yung f of x sub n, nag approach sa negative 1. Pag n is even naman, yung f of x sub n, nag approach sa positive 1. So, therefore, yung limit ng f of x sub n does not exist. At kung hindi nag exist yung limit, therefore, yung limit ng signum function f uh, x as x approaches 0 does not exist. And this is done.